hello and welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to show you how to create a local pacman repo so in order to create the repo you need to have the packages downloaded and then you can add those packages to the the, the repo itself so first of all i'm going to create uh, a folder for the repo and the packages so i'm going to call it custom repo so i'm going to call the folder custom repo and i'm going to cd into it and here is where i'm going to download the packages so before we download the packages we need to create another folder a temporary folder in slash temp i'll call it blank db as indicated by the arch wiki so this is where we'll tell pacman to download the databases so the command to cache packages in the current folder is sudo pacman minus s yyw minus minus cache here dot slash minus minus db path slash temp slash blank db and curl or the name of the packages you want to download for the simplicity i am just going to download curl in the tutorial but you can do as many packages as you want so let me explain the command the minus syy tells pacman to download the databases again and the w tells pacman to not install the package into the system but just to cache it and the minus cache there flag actually tells pacman the path of the caching directory since we want to cache the uh, the packages in the this directory i'm going to say dot slash and the minus minus db path tells pacman to place the databases in the folder or the path we have told so which is slash temp slash blank db if i hit enter you can see it is going to download the databases from start in the folder called slash temp slash blank db if i ls as you can see you know it's downloading its databases and now as you can see since we have downloaded the databases in a temporary space it allows pacman actually downloads every dependency and every package needed for curl to work because when we are creating a repository we don't know if the target system has all the dependencies or not so we download the dependencies just to be safe so i'm going to hit enter and i'll see you guys after this is done as you can see we are done downloading the packages and if i list the contents of this folder you can see we have a lot of packages and these are all the packages and dependencies you know needed for curl to work so now we are going to create the repository so first we are going to create an empty repository using the command repo dash add and then the name of your repository i'm going to name it my db my uh, my repo so after your name you need to have an extension of dot db dot tar dot gz so the complete name of my repo is going to be my repo dot db dot tar dot gz so hit enter and as you can see it has created an empty database now i'm going to essentially add every package that i have downloaded into this repository so the command is same repo dash add the name of your repository followed by the you know the name of the packages you want to add of course i'm going to use a wildcard here so i'm going to say dot slash star dot tar dot zst so add any file which has an extension of tar dot zst at then then know these are packages and if i hit enter it is going to add all of those packages then there are some packages with different extensions like dot tar dot xz so we're going to add them as well with by changing the ending extension and as you can see we have done that and i don't think so there are any packages with an extension dot tar dot gz but let's do that anyways you can see it says error because we are trying to add my repo dot db dot tar dot gz which is of course not a package file so you have done it and the repo is ready you can use this custom repo for offline installation of arch linux or if you want to manage different you know uh, a lot of um a lot of like you know uh, offline devices or devices a number of devices so that you, instead of downloading the these packages again and again for each and every device you could use this repository put it in a usb stick and use it whenever you want so this is it for this video if you liked if you like the video be sure to like it if you did not dislike feedback goes in the comment section and i hope to see you guys again soon bye